Hello, I'm Rebecca and I'm an Apprentice Administrator for the Friendly Training Hub. And I've been on the Business Administration Level 3 for eight months now. I applied for this apprenticeship as it was um, a career move for me. I've spent the last 22 years working in the childcare um, development area and I just needed something different to do. So I saw the apprenticeship um, advertised and thought it was a great opportunity. I've been for many interviews wanting to go into administration, but unfortunately I never had an interview or I wasn't chosen, didn't get the job, just not having the experience or qualification. So this apprenticeship is fantastic. It's a great opportunity as I'm learning on the job and achieving the qualification as well. I thought starting out as an apprenticeship, it would be more a case of I am a student, um, learning from the very, very beginning. But even right from the start, I never experienced of being a student. I've always felt part of the team. I think to begin with, it was a little bit daunting going back to studying after having so many years out of school and not having that. But it's actually been quite a good balance. Um, the study time that you have, as well as work time, it, it's quite flexible and it just works really well. To begin with, when I started, um, I felt I slightly um, isolated due to working from home, but we overcome that issue um, by using MS Teams. Um, I found that chatting to my line manager on a daily basis and then being introduced to the whole team, I was then confident enough to, to then call anyone if I was stuck or, or felt isolated or needed help, guidance. The team were fantastic and were able to support me, so I, I lost that isolation feeling. With my function skills, with my maths, I was quite nervous, if I'm honest, to begin with, because, again, not having done maths since my school days, it was a bit daunting. But the support, again, is fantastic. Um, each lesson you're guided through, um, if there's anything you're unsure about, it's just easy to, to say you don't understand something and it's processed in a different way. If I'm quite a visual person and my tutor understands that, so if there's anything that I don't understand, it's processed in a different way so I, I'm able to do it. Um, again, the support's been fantastic and I've, again, learnt so much and I feel more confident within my maths now. So during our workshops, we do several activities to help through for endpoint assessment. Um, one is we do question and answers, so we'll have questions and it's just a general answer. Then we have multiple choice questions, so it's more exam style, so we're getting used to the paper. And throughout the workshop itself, when we're talking about a subject, it's mentioned, oh, this needs to go into your portfolio for endpoint assessments. Then we gather the information to put into our uh, portfolio. <laughs> my apprenticeship work, I have regular time slots which, placed, which is placed on my calendar for everyone to see. These time slots are flexible. For example, so if I'm running an event or something urgent arises. So the next steps for me with my apprenticeship once I'm qualified. Um, ideally, I'd, I'd love to stay working within the team. Um, I found that I've been supported so, so well and I get on really well with all the team members. I love the little team that we have. Um, so if I'm lucky enough to stay on, um, I would love that. At the start of my apprenticeship, um, like on a scale of 1 to 10, I would have given myself 1 um, due to the fact I had no sort of knowledge, um, could only really send emails if I'm honest. But now, eight months in, I can do so much more and I would rate myself eight and I'm still learning, there's still so much to do. So my proudest moment of the apprenticeship so far, it's been event organising and being able to plan an event from start to finish. I've had to communicate with suppliers and negotiate on prices. And before the apprenticeship, I've never had the experience of doing this. Apprenticeships are a great opportunity to develop your skills within the workplace. If you are selected for an interview, make sure you do your research on the organisation. 
and you understand the programme that you will be studying.